Hello roomies, we are back with another video for today um, regarding the update on this hair that I have purchased a month ago. Before we go ahead and get started, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you can be notified when my videos have been uploaded. Let's get right into the video. Show me my love. This hair I've had for a month now. I've been uploading every Monday um, videos about me customizing this hair, this wig to my liking. The last video that I did upload was me highlighting this hair, putting in some goldish, blondish highlights in it. Um, but I did not like it, so I did go ahead and do a red color you can't really see the fullness of the red because the hair is wet but this is more of my touch um so let's go ahead and get right into the what i want where do i want to start let's get into the maintenance this hair needs to be maintenanced every day between every day and every three days so that's a little high maintenance for me but that is expected because it is curly hair curly hair you cannot just get up and go as for straight hair you can get up and go and do whatever but for this hair what I use to maintenance it I use a spray bottle um, I switch between Cantu custard this is the shea butter miracle bouncy curls pudding and then sometimes I go with my miss miss Jessie's and then leave-in conditioner so that's four products here just for one wig that is a lot of product um well that's a lot of product to maintain this hair which is to be expected you are to co-wash this hair every three days to just to make sure that it doesn't mat up in the back also you do need a Denman brush which I have here just trying to get some of this hair out and show y'all something okay so this is my Denman brush I purchased this from Walmart and whenever I do co-wash the hair or you know do a, a wash and go this is how much I've cut hair I've collected in the span of a week which is not bad not bad curly hair is to be expected to shed um the cost of this hair wasn't bad either I'm not sure how much I paid for it, but I will either leave it right here or right here this is an 18 inch lace front wig this has no combs in it it just has adjustable straps in the back the parting space is about in the middle it's about four inches on the sides it's about two or three inches um that's a little bad for me because i usually wear my hair in the side part and i like deep side parts so from right here to right here so it's it's these it's the space in between this and at the back of it you can feel the first track after the lace front so if you're looking for more parting space I would say this is not the wig for you um the ends of this hair this is how it looks ends are great and this is me this is after I've bleached the hair and dyed it now as far as nighttime care what I suggest you do is either twist it up Put your water you know as you if you're natural how you will do your hair or put it in a um a high ponytail and a satin head wrap don't want cotton don't want anything else but satin just to make sure that the hair stays soft what else can i say about this hair i love it so far it's been a month this is all of the hair to the front it comes right so if i stretch it out it comes right here to me this is what it's stretched out with it not being stretched out it comes right here my height is short 
five two and a half. So this is a very good length for me. Um, this is 18 inches, I believe. Eight inches of curly hair. Again, this is all of the hair to the front. Push it to the back. And that's that. I'm loving this hair. This hair is from RXY. This was purchased with my own coin. As far as longevity, I think you can get about a year out of this hair. What? No. Now, if you're a person that doesn't really know how to take care of hair as of yet, this is not the hair for you. I would suggest starting out with straight hair. Um, and then working your way up to curly hair when I when I got this hair I was very hesitant of purchasing well when I was looking for hair I was very hesitant of purchasing this hair for the simple fact that the first curly hair that I purchased I damaged it completely I purchased a It was three bundles and a closure of some kinky curly hair And I didn't know what I was doing. I didn't know how to take care of it And it just matted up really bad. So I ended up throwing that away and starting over um, with just getting straight hairs, body waves, no curly hair. But I stepped out of my norm and got this curly hair, which I am in love with. I love the curls. I love the curls completely. Let's go back to the co-washing. Um, when you co-wash your hair, you do not want to use an inexpensive conditioner because you wouldn't. the results won't be as good. Um with a more expensive brand i use tresemme love tresemme love the results um the brand uh well the one i use is moisture rich i believe but yeah that's what i use for co-washing i do not shampoo this hair at all because after i've done res um research it does say that when you're shampooing curly hair it does strip it really bad of the color of you know the strands you'll then start experience balding so I would not recommend shampooing this hair just straight conditioning and co-washing and doing washing goals and things like that that's what I have gotten used to my next video will be on different styles that you can do with this wig um oh yeah by the way I did not glue down the back of this wig for the simple fact that the place I work at I tend to sweat a lot so I don't need nothing if I was to glue this down in the bag I'll just have to keep gluing it every other day which I do not have the time to do but yes the next video that I will have up will be of different styles you can do with this hair and how I use these products that I did mention in the beginning on this hair and the process that it takes and all the extra things that you need to know about oh excuse me mm, maintaining this hair but that is it for today's video want to thank you all so very much for tuning in don't forget to like comment subscribe and hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when my videos have been uploaded until then see you in my next one bye how y'all feeling this i'm feeling it I'm feeling it. I'm back. Did you hit that subscribe button? It's right there on the bottom. You did it. Thanks.